Auto Motorcycle Club Phaeton was founded in 2001. Near the entrance uh, you uh, can find an open area uh, where you can see uh, some different things like torpedo, uh, helicopter, tank and so on. But the most interesting is of course inside. At the left side you will see a small cafe in, a, in an old Volkswagen, yeah? And near the cash desk uh, you will find uh, two autos, yes. Uh, I think this is the only objects, the only autos where you can sit uh, and to make photos, because other objects inside the museum only watch and don't touch. In museum there are different halls dedicated to different autos. For example, now in the video you can see the autos uh, which were uh, produced outside of the area Soviet Union. Also, please uh, take attention to the uh, small children's cars. You know, it was a fashion in the 60s, 70s uh, of last century uh, to accustom children, children uh, to the brand name of cars producers. So all the children's cars uh, were produced under the brand name of uh, Volkswagen or Peugeot. <laughs> And here we can see uh, the whole line of cars uh, which were produced in the former Soviet Union. Uh, Niva, Vaz, Moskvich, maybe you uh, got acquainted with such brands. And maybe 50 years ago they uh, were well known in the whole world. Next call is dedicated to the different household items. No any comments left to say, just to see. Uh, the only bad thing here that in this house there is very bad ventilation. You know, all these items are very old and of course there is very specific smell. And as for me, for example, uh, I stayed here maybe for 3 or 4 minutes. It's impossible to stay here more. So I applied to the owner of the museum, please change something, because the hall is very interesting, but you know, due to specific smell and absence of fresh air, it's very difficult to stay here more than some minutes, please.
okay, and this hall is dedicated to the scooters and motorcycles. Uh, you can see uh, how they look like <laughs> uh, for uh, 50, 70 years ago. And in another floor you uh, will find a big collection of motorcycles, sorry, bicycles, yes, and a lot of uh, specific uh, cars which were produced in the Soviet Union. And the whole line is of course dedicated to the uh, ZAS autos or uh, the Russian language Zaporozhye's autos. If you know it in Zap Zaporizhia city, yes, here was the only uh, plant in Soviet Union which produced uh, mini cars. Uh, I mean, uh, mini cars, I mean, with the volume of engine between 0 0.7 and 1.2 liters. So uh, you can see how they looked like. To regret this plant was closed several years ago. And the last hole uh, you can uh, see, you can find military uh, techniques. Autos, motorcycles, weapons, uh, equipment and so on and so on. So just uh, for people who uh, like uh, military style. So even you are not uh, a fan of technology, anyway, uh, please find time to visit this museum because it's uh, generally the coolest place, <laughs> one of the coolest places in Ukraine. So welcome to Python Museum.